If you want to get to know a location and its data, you can start by looking up its profile on Census Reporter. Based on interviews with journalists and other data users, our profile pages focus on the most frequently used statistics. Each page provides figures and charts for the selected information. We'll use Chicago as an example. At the top of each profile page, you'll see a population count for the given area, the size of the area, and its population density. This section of the page also tells you which larger areas any given place is located in. Here you can see the counties, metro area, and state for the city of Chicago. The rest of the page features more data on topics like demographics, including age and sex, economics, including income and poverty, families, including household and marital status, housing, including occupancy and value, and social, including educational attainment and language. To get some perspective on the data, you can use your cursor to hover over the figures. The pop-up box compares the data from this specific place, Chicago, to the same data collected from surrounding areas. For a deeper look at the numbers, there's an option to show data below each chart. You can see the actual totals in addition to percentages. And again, compare the data from this specific place to surrounding areas. You can also click View Table to see the complete data from the American Community Survey. Because the figures from the American Community Survey are estimates, there will be margins of error for the data. These are listed in gray to the right of each estimate. They also appear when you scroll over specific numerical values. Census Reporter notes when margins of error are at least 10%. You can use these charts for your own stories or websites. There's an option to embed the code into your own CMS or HTML by copying and pasting the markup text. Like we mentioned before, the profile pages are curated, but there's so much more information from the American Community Survey. If you're looking for any other data, use the search bar to type in a topic. You'll get results tailored for the specific location. And if you're wondering how to give credit for the information you found on Census Reporter, you can see citations at the bottom of each profile page. That was our look into using profile pages on Census Reporter. If you have any more questions, check out our other videos or send us a message.